Hey, what's up? Um, what are you going for? <laughs> this is Emma. <laughs> Emma Marie. What's your last name? John? What? I don't know. Whatever her name is. We don't call her E for today. E came to me in the beginning. I think y'all saw her hair in another video. And it was short, and I was telling y'all these little brown hairs. You know, by them being brown, the uh, enamel of them are as strong. So you gotta do different things to them, moisturize them a little more. E eat everything. So E get moisturization from everything. You think I'm playing? Look at this thigh. It's ashy too, look at it. You see that? This nigga eat everything. So she get moisturization from it all. I ain't lying. All her food and everything. So now the hair is growing. What's your main meal? We're laughing, you know I ain't lying. Come crab on. legs. Crab legs. It's protein in them crabs, so yeah, I guess so. And, and she played football. Oh, you made me drop a damn cone. Boom, boom. That's all right. God is gonna wash me one time. I'm tired of doing these videos. <laughs> we're going to get up. Okay, I'm going to go to the drive. Uh, this is not the head. Yes, you, you got bang. You do your school. That's all right. You're going to do it together. Paint it in there. You do like Shara do it. Doing it too, like, you know what you're doing. <laughs> <laughs> sure, be shaking that baby. So, little mo. <laughs> like, she got the magic shake. <laughs> but no, back to seriousness. So, um, I've learned that, you know, eating the right things, even though, you know, you are overindulging and eating a lot, it still helps moisturize the body and the hair. Bones and everything. You know, her bones gotta be strong. That's not a normal thing. That's not. So, with this hole in it now, you better not say one bad word. Say one. Say one. Look, she didn't even have all of these things. Remember, sweet? She didn't have none of this. <laughs> she had none of this. We wasn't doing that much bothering, but she got some hair now. Hey, were you stressed out in your last relationship? <laughs> No. No? No, I wasn't really. Okay, so you're not an M&M popper right now. Right? No. No, you know some people, they get depressed. And that's how they start getting away from I call yeah. it the nutty professor syndrome. This is definitely happy way. That's happiness? This is happiness. What? So, yeah. Uh, yeah. I wouldn't be. Does that make it good? Because it's happy? Yeah. It uh, makes it okay. Oh, it's okay. <laughs> it's still unhappy. It's not right. Right, okay. Well, at least you know the risk and the pros and the pump and your hair is growing, so hey. Okay. Can't knock it. Can't knock it at all. She can use her thighs for good. She be knocking people over. Like they be. Oh. Like that. <laughs> she won't fly in. <laughs> what are you implying? I was gonna clip your hands. I'm gonna let you walk out here like clutch no. the damn bag. No. That's too bad. Since you got jokes. I love you though. Yeah. <laughs> Damn bowling pin. <laughs> Grow up. Like Me? Yes. Tell my thigh needs a lot. strong bone. You do? Wait till she Can walk. you cut that off, God? Oh, okay. Wait till she walks in the drive. She's over to having fun. But the, the great thing is when she played football, but when we put her in the drive, football is not in the air. <laughs> it is not. You don't know what football smells like. Hey, man. Football and dreadlocks. All right, this is Spider-Man. Spider-Man got about, what are you just saying, about 165 to 177 amount of locks in his head. And he was just questioning me what size his lock was going to be. Glad that happened. Heart to lock ratio is extremely important. Extremely, extremely important. So for y'all out there that's doing the African method, where they got the big, big, like right here, this is the, the middle size lock. And then all around the edges, they got the freestyle parts. It's not gonna work. It's gonna be so ugly. It is, they're gonna be forced into Rastafarianism. Is that a word? Is that a word? 
I just made that up. Thank God, good. What's the dictionary just planted in my head? That is awesome. But yes, he's gonna have a lot here. What you guys want to make sure and know first? <laughs> Oh, you posted. Oh, she hit me, Katie. Let me get you five. Let me get your five seconds. Go ahead. And All right. <laughs> <laughs> what you guys need to know is one. Once the lock begins to bud, that is going to be the point of the lock journey that you are going to hate the most. I hear it all the time. Can you cut that? When we can do this with this? Ooh, what about this puppy end? What is, what's going to happen with that? All of it is the starting of your locking situation. It's very necessary that you leave that alone if you want to have a lock. Now at this point, he's all the way locked, but we're waiting for the lock to tighten up and become extremely mature. So at this point, he, he can take them apart. He will lose a lot of hair but he could take them apart. But at the same time, he's still locked up and all of this is a blood. So all of this from here on out is just gonna become tighter, more mature, more moisturized, more everything. Pretty much a more enhanced lock as time goes on. And now down the line, if he's doing what Spider-Man is supposed to do, then you know his lock store is where it needs to be. So far, he's doing good. I like it when they come in, they can get shampoo, they had just stick up like, ow, I like that. <laughs> I don't know why I'm weird, but again, they'll go into the dryer and get clipped down. And I don't, I don't put a whole bunch of clips in here. I don't feel like it's necessary to just be clipped on one lock. You got the whole head. They better than dry it. Dry just be heating them clips up. Just be frying that scalp. They be sitting there for like 18 years trying to get dry. You got all of these clips that just reflect in the sunlight off the lock. It ain't gonna work. You play football later, thanks by the way. Uh, When's basketball season? It's actually slow. How do you think it's gonna work out for you? Have you had have you played with them since? Yeah. Yeah. It's hard to do this with you because now I'm out of town now, so I'm where you at now? I'm in that girl, I'm just back in town. Oh, you got there where ain't nothing. Yeah, it's crazy. Y'all be talking to trees and stuff, don't you? <laughs> You're crazy, huh? Let me catch you talking to a tree. I swear, I promise you, I never said another word to you. That's what's up. That's good. Well, another sports person making it happen in the game to show you it's possible. So either you sweating or you eating a whole bunch of food like that one over there. Either way. So now I'm learning that we have a, a distributing line that is endorsing co-washing. This young baby came in today, bless her spirit, her soul, and her heart, and told me that design, not design essential, excuse me, the McBride. I'm not even going to disrespect y'all like that. I want to say uh, Carol's daughter has a co-wash. What is this co-wash, quote unquote, we're going to use air quotes. What does it do for you? Well, really, all it does is condition it, just my primary song. Just condition it all over again, on top of all of that filth from your life. <laughs> and they didn't even tell you to wash your hair. They just said, go ahead and just on top of that dirt, baby, just make it soft again. <laughs> soft and nasty. That is not going to work, people. That's not going to work. Now, what happened here is she got a little breakage. Breakage can come from filthy hair. It sure can. It will come because all that dirt and oil will just clog up that follicular levels and those pores and cut off that oxygen straight to that hair. You will not have growth anymore. Cold wash, no wash, or roll wash. I don't care what kind of wash it is. If it ain't shampoo, it ain't wash. That's not a wash. You see how big my eyes are? That is not a wash. I, was, I mean, I understand the, the things you guys are going for here, but that's not a shampoo. And you are not clean from just putting a smoothie. So how can I explain this? Take your dirty hands and just go rinse them off in some oil. And see what's gonna happen then. I bet you won't put your hands in your mouth. I bet you you won't. Because they're not gonna be clean. Also, put some of that. What's that stuff called that folks are drinking these days? What's that stuff called, Shabuda? Oh wait. That stuff that people are drinking. 
stuff that you rub on your hand, make your hand feel like you can chew the piece of winter fresh. Oh, the antibacterial? Yeah. They would use that. Put that on your hand and put your hand in your mouth to see how nasty it tastes. It ain't clean. Cleanliness comes from cleaning agents. That is not a cleaning agent. And it's just softening up the hair. And I mean, it's, it's good that you want to moisturize and all of those things, but the hair needs to be clean to get its best level of moisturization and uh, conditioning. Like, you just can't condition filthy hair. It, it's not going to do anything. It's going to counterbalance. Put water on top of oil, it's going to counterbalance. Don't do that. Don't do that. You can stop doing that. I'm very serious. Stop doing it. It's not, it's, it's just not beneficial for anybody. Okay? Good day. Hey. So we got some other locks here. They were starting in February. Well, I got my hand on them in February. Before February, Shara's cousin was going <laughs> over at the African shop. And this baby was just letting me know every time she got a retwist, she looked like she got a freedom cut. I don't, I mean, freedom cut and retwist are two different things. That's, that's just not the same dynamic. What Caprice with? Come here. Oh, she just don't want all those things. Oh, sprinkle her hair. Right. See that right there? Your starter locks look like that? You didn't start them. That ain't a starter lock. That's the front. That ain't gonna work. So cut it out. But we got our hands in and now we're manipulating and doing something totally different using substantial products and making it work. I just wanted to show you this. What, where are you from? What's your last name? Rodriguez, Gonzalez, Pujoles. What was your last name? Balthazar. Who? That's right, the Harry Potter last name. <laughs> uh, <laughs> so you know she's not from America. But just wanted to show you some more hair. Loose curly. Harry Potter here. Bye. <laughs> now, another situation has just happened, and I am just thoroughly, thoroughly confused. I would say pissed off, but confused. Check this out. This baby broke off all of this hair, even all around the edges. And when that, I repeat, Will not let me cut this off. I'm pissed. This is not the game. This is beyond foolishness. Now let's get down to the nitty gritty. Do you see these right here? I've done these and started these and done these and started these over and over again. And every time he comes, he still has a few left. And again, he won't let me cut it off. Won't let me do what I know is necessary. All he wants to do is what he wants to do. And he has a mother that's allowing him to do what he wants to do. Now, at this point, if I had some little clippers that you could change the blade on, I promise you I would squeeze ball the mess out of him. Because this is self-inflicted. This is not something that people have done to you. This is done to self. And a comfort zone will keep this going, but I can tell you one thing. This ain't the way to the cross. Nowhere near. And he ought to be ashamed of himself, but baby, since he had to with this mess, I'm going to go and give him a lot of tap tap on the top of that head and hook up them four locks and send him on to Jesus. Now, if he come back in the next time and he only got one and a half, who problem is that? Not mine. I did my part. I tried to educate this baby and tell him what he needs to do. But now I'm not going to fight you and make you do nothing. You hear me? But look at this. Oh my god. You got more nappy hat than you got dreadlocks. Bless his day. <laughs> this baby. He just don't understand. And for those out there in this same position, you pulling them lots back and doing that Donald Trump cover up. I bless your heart. And your days. And the little hairs you got left. And you need to go sit up under somebody and get conditioned till you die. Because this brittle, dry, breaking mess. Ain't it. It just ain't it. It is time to palm roll. <gasps> Pay attention! Okay, it's early. But anyway, today it's time to palm roll. Today, he has been locked for six months. And, I mean, I can take the comb and I can get in there and do 
like some of y'all do. This is where I get a lot of dishes go wrong. And you do that right there. Uh, damn, I can't even do it. Uh, you just do that part right there. You see, you got all that left. Mm -hmm. Toy. And you see how you got all that left right there? That's that's not what's up. You didn't do that right. So again, second lesson. Well, actually, it's like what lesson number fifteen or something. Two. You cannot plumb roll without putting the right amount of solution on here too. And I don't mean just taking your hand and scooping your mama out that jail and you better that. That's not good. Work on it. You work out everything? You do? On the work? On a daily basis? On a daily basis? That's a good place. You swim that? Yeah. Awesome. Watch my hair. You told you to wash your hair? I tell you. <laughs> <laughs> That's what everybody else do. I tell you to wash your hair. I tell you to do nothing to that. You can leave that alone. That was a message. That's a good thing that you shampoo. What do you shampoo with? Uh, lotion. Who? Oh, lotion. Lotion's what? I'm not with anything. I'm saying which one? You just, you just pick something out of the chair? <laughs> Who's in that store with you? Nobody. You do that by yourself? Come here. What I do? Why you let him go to the beauty club by himself? Oh? Huh? Why you let him go to the beauty club by himself? Why you are? I was with him with you the whole time. Hold on, wait, you been out there. He said you, he, he was in there by himself and he went about that motion, baby. He don't even no, know No, my dad been. bought that motion for me. Your dad bought it? Yeah, for my hair. What, is it a condition? Yeah. Mm. You got a conditioner? And shampoo, we got the cream. Is it two and one? No. So, you got a clarifier too? Uh uh, we got the cream shampoo. You need a clarifier also. Because that cream shampoo, all you need to do is just leave oils in there, and then you'll have a build up down the line too. That's so, it's a, good, it's a good thing to have, but you also want to make sure the scalp is clean when you do it. When you shampoo, you don't, you don't have an issue with your hair being that, that fuzzy look afterwards. I kind of diffuse all of that. At least you tie it up. What you tie it up with? A do rag. I'm gonna fight. I ain't gonna lie. I ain't gonna lie. Sometimes I can't use the uh, the cap. What kind of cap? The cap used to wear the You know, I'm gonna kill it. I'm gonna kill it. I'm gonna push the beanie. The beanie? That's not good one. You need a satin scarf. Y'all at home just revamping stuff? Just turn it off. It's alright. Yeah. He be using stuff, right? Hold on. When he get tired, I keep on telling him to tie his hair up. He do what? When he get tired. Tired? Yeah. Uh-huh. Why you gotta get tired? I had to break up until he get tired now. Oh, from working. Well, she at least you got a job, but some people make a job. I can respect that. Go to work. No, now. Right. <laughs> I mean that. I ain't learned. Somebody told me over the weekend, now I'm out the whole next three weeks. No, you ain't got a damn job. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't know nobody ever let you off with a paper three weeks. Good luck. You ain't got no job. Damn. <laughs> what kind of workout are you doing? Uh, mostly running. Working on the lift. You working on the lift? It's a beat. Who? Wheels and tires? You got the hook up? Look at him, look at him. Right on Bel-Air. Right on Bel-Air. What y'all do? Fix flats? No. You tie your hair up when you wake up? Yeah. He ain't gonna hang on. I was about to say. You know, I'm a snob, baby. I'll be up here ready to fight just because you didn't tie up your hair. He told him to say it every day at work. That's good. I'll be home. You do what? I'll be home. That's good. 
Hey man, she be on him. That's what's up. You ever twisted it for him at night time? Huh? You ever twisted it for him at night time? I tried it, but he don't want me to do it. He don't want me to mess it up. Right. <laughs> yeah, but that's good. That's good. That's what's happening there. What day did you start this again? March 6th. March 7th. That is your birthday. Oh. Uh, you started on Sharita Day. Hey. You want to tell everybody on YouTube, she's going to get towed up on Facebook. Oh. <laughs> be I'm dreaming of you for your birthday, Kim. Bless you. <laughs> Yes. I get one more tweet. Oh, did you see the comment on my Instagram? Uh -uh. I want Sharita to watch my house. <laughs> yes, baby. They said this, uh, that last video. They said it was sexual. <laughs> Sharita be in here trying to uh, share booze in a barn. <laughs> I don't know about the play. I didn't do it. You know I got the folks in here hooping and hollering. Yeah, oh, wow. Just from water. You swear they take no bath. <laughs> You're crazy. <laughs> they did it. Just, oh. Thank you, Lord. Especially them chocolate milk scabs. They be ready for you to get in there. <laughs> Red neck. Can you go to Beauty Supply and get a smile? Yeah, you go to Beauty Supply, Walmart. Anywhere. You probably go to church and ask somebody to donate you one. They'll give you a catch. Oh, you know, they got some scars. Back in the gap, everybody had about 17 scars. Mm -hmm. You got the one that got the purple bow on the outside. The one that looked like Versace. You got the one that says Chanel. Jesus, Jesus is number one all over it. <laughs> Jesus loves me. Yes. Heart. Yes. Oh, oh, my favorite, my favorite, my favorite, my favorite. The Lord's Baton with the upside down feet. Oh my God. Looking like LA Lakers got that. <laughs> <laughs> they be wearing that shit just tucked there like an ascot. Just, I'm going to church, bitch. I am going to church. <laughs> what? Where are you going? Oh, no. You seen them before? Yeah. They're just ready. Tucked tight and in that shirt. Bet you won't bend down. That shit will fall straight up. Clearly. But that's, yeah, you can go anywhere that you want. Anywhere. Y'all grandma all right? Y'all grandma all right? Your grandma got stars. She got about as much stars as she got some stockings in that drawer. You know she got some stockings. I know him. He ain't want to do all that. Hey, hey. He picky. He won't have. <laughs> you better get one of those, those stars and go to sleep. Tied up like Angel Mama's nephew. That bow in front. I got a flower scarf. He don't want to wear it. Who gonna see you? Oh, <laughs> Stay at the mirror. You wouldn't even know it had flowers. It's, it may break out your skin tone. <laughs> <laughs> you don't want to be up in there just iridescent for the night. At least you got your edges. <laughs> edges. Oh, baby. I saw this girl. She had this long ponytail. I tell you, it's about. Uh, right there, just right with these butt cheeks. Hey, ain't had none of this. <laughs> I was like, bitch. Compensating me. That Erica about do look is out of there. <laughs> Erica did that shit a long time ago. Come on. She could at least put a little dark makeup right there and contour it in, maybe like the drag queens and like they like they had like you yeah. know. You know what I'm talking about? Just pastymade.com. Oh, she could have got some Chinese backing. I was just about to say she should have swooped it. I'm the Donald Trump. That nigga got billions and still just. <laughs> Straight to Omo. I'm telling you. And he don't care. Okay? That boy endorsed some gym. Just put oh, it in now. Jail. Guess what? He ain't got lots of Kevin on our team. You know what? When I was when I had lots, look at what I did. I had this purple shirt. I cut the bottom off the purple shirt. I had like this. What's going on over here? Uh, stretching my arm. Can you continue? You just... <laughs> <laughs> Where you going? Uh, this heavy camera. Can you just continue? Nah, boo. Nah, boo. I know what you're doing. Who next? Tiffany. Tiffany. I don't know about the play. Around. Tiffany. She got some stuff. She got some stuff. She got some stuff. She got some stuff. 
coming on in. It's gonna be a to be continued. <laughs> what was I saying? I forgot. The yeah. 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 just took me out the door. Flex and shit. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so I had a, a, a stocking, a stocking cap that had about three holes in it. So I would wrap my hair first, then I put the stocking cap, then I put the scarf on. Okay, I wake up in the morning, had a fresh edge up. My shit was so tight. <laughs> you couldn't tell me the other one. My hair would be laid down. And if I knew there would be some issues, I'd spray it with water. But don't y'all do that at home. That's, that's not the issue. My hair was so damn dry. <laughs> it was. That was nervous. This hair's laid down. I bet it does. He always up there in that sun. Yeah. It's because it's winter time. You should get 162 degrees in. Yeah. Huh? You don't get tired of your fingers being black? No, I hate it. You hate it? You use lava soap? You ever took a bath with lava soap? That shit will dry your whole body. That shit will dry you, girl. You want to be ashy? Bathe with some lava soap. You'll be a white woman. <laughs> Today we had a client come in and here we go. Some more tell all this nigga business segment. Look at Sharita. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Woo! Can you say uh Double fudge, chocolate milk dipped in corn sauce and vomit all at the same time. Just three organic cleansers. She had to refill the goddamn bottle just to wash his hair. <laughs> that is a shame. Look at that bottle. And it's still disrespecting. What you see now? Uh, it's caramel, not chocolate. It's caramel? Yes. Fourth shampoo and you still got caramel? I'm not twisting him up. I'm telling you now, that's not going to work. Look at him. He's smiling. Like a homeless man had a bath for the first time. Bless his heart. Scratch real good. I want to see what he's going to do. <laughs> Aphrodisiac. <laughs> That's that what would Jesus do shampoo. <laughs> oh. How many locks he got? Four. Four with branches. Sharita, you saw me. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> I'm clear. Some more still coming out? It's no. Yellow. It's yellow. That's urine. How, like, how did that happen? What do you think that is? Speechless. Uh. And how many years you been working for me? Since I was six? I mean, look at them all. Stretch arms strong. Sharita be working out at that world gym, been making it happen. That's why she wearing that smock these days. Daydreaming. <laughs> now this one here pisses me off. Do you see this bottle spot? And look at these locks. I'm gonna show you something right quick. Look at this. Check this out right here. You got crab legs to it. Ain't no tomorrow. Beyond crab legs, if that was a crab, that crab would be deformed. There would be no reason why it should have 15 tentacles on one branch. But you did it. And then you let somebody put a damn two strand in here. To be, <laughs> it's supposed to be your lock extension. Ooh, God bless your heart. Jesus. But at the same time, I want you to know this. This is a not the business. This ain't it. And he makes me mad because every time he come in here, they know I'd be so filthy and stank and full of grime and grit and crap. I be wanna be I swear to God. That is not what's up.
trying to do was swap. Nah, it was swap. What kind of swap? I guess it was the big black guy. It was like a green one. Nah. Chef, no body wash and conditioner. <laughs> like I had, I haven't been to the shop in a no. while. <laughs> no. I couldn't even really do it though, cause like it wasn't getting out like soaking. Let's see, this is how you, this is where you just look like this, bro. I'll, I'll no, that's because this lady was dead. Yeah, I think she cut my head up too far back. Because when I first moved, she's still driving, right? It's out there. It's out there. It's out there. It's back here, back here. You can't be. It's great. 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 I mean, it's evident here, but you got it all other places, too. But this right here, this added hair, this added straight Pinecolon synthetic hair is a hair now. Oh, the lady told me it was like a airflow type. What type? Did you see the half the I think I seen it. It was like a puppy like like weed, you know? Why was that it? Hey, it was nothing. Like it ain't even mad. It's coming off. What sucks? But. No swab, no body wash. <laughs> Don't wash your hair with body wash. No, it was like a three in the morning. It's sealed, it's a body wash. Yeah. You, know, you, know, you don't need to use that. That's not going to be good. What was that? He has been to so many places. They have used honey on this boy. They wrapped him with whatever. I think they have regular people not at the shop too. How long have you had these days? This is my second year. You have two years. The person that answers for to be out for somebody in the house. So, you know, Equal opportunity employee. Yeah, Starting me out for the house. Then eventually, I allow me to start with my family. But anyway, who else? After Miss Hill and I went to Miss Dan, yeah. And uh, she was the one who really, I think, started using money. Like, so they were talking all this crap about it. Yeah. You were in jail and all that too? No, I, the only time I had somebody in jail was when I first got the gun. What were they using? They were using the. Uh, at first they were using these wigs, and then people were hell. Yeah, people were telling me, they was like, bro, you don't need these wigs to be ready. So I stopped it. Yeah, it was like, I'm getting the fever. That was like the last person I did. Yeah, I done had a couple of like, if they, like I had a one lady in my hair and I was a little lady offered to do my hair for free. Ain't nothing free, a true album. So, guess what? Ticket butt. I will be in New York. Make it that what? Make it that oh. Mm. 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 I'm excited. <laughs> I'm excited. I will be there December 22nd, working in that Manhattan area. So that will be on the list and LA is next so for all you folks that are in the surrounding areas please come come join we're gonna have church we're gonna be sitting in there with our wine well, is that what they call it wine mine gonna be real wine real merlot we're gonna be crazy you talking about blood I'm talking about the what blood blood that's what communion wine is supposed to represent I'm about to say what the fuck drinking blood <laughs> Take me out my misery and make me feel all